The Trans Day of Remembrance is about grieving for the people that we have lost and that people need to sit in that uncomfortable space of sadness, of, of loss for all of those lives so brutally taken from our community. We are gentle. This day, November the 20th, it's a day for all of us to come together and to honor our brothers and sisters who have perished. Rafaela Cavalcante de Silva, age 21, date October 2nd, 2014, in Fortaleza, Brazil. The intersex stand with the transgender Gavioto Wilton dos Santos, age 35, Rio Largo, Brazil, dated 10 to 14. Bless her. We know that this year in the United States, at least 22 people have been murdered. We know that some of those murders are still under investigation. Name, unnamed, age, not reported. Date 10 5, 14, where an unnamed city in Argentina, repeatedly beaten with various objects on the face. Jin Jinjine Gul, uh, age not reported, died 10 9 2014, Istanbul, Turkey. We know that some of our brothers and sisters continue to be murdered on a way that is not necessarily with knives or guns, but are killed with words, are killed with looks, are killed with remarks. Wilman Jose, Wilman Jose, Wilman Cassiani, age 29, December 5th, 2014, Maracaibo, Venezuela, repeatedly beaten on the face. Ashley Sherman, 25, date 10 27 14 in Indianapolis. Ashley was a person of color. I've buried some of my sisters. I had raised funds to bury some of my sisters. And I can tell you that I am tired. I am tired that this continues to happen to all of us. Tadinha, uh, age 18, on February 1st, 2015, in Vitoria de Santo Atao, uh, Brazil, Tadinha was a person of color. Kitty Collins, age 60, Atlanta, Georgia, USA. Police arrested Kitty's partner, a 58-year-old man, as a suspect. Personally, November the 20th for me is a sad day. But I have learned in the last few years to try to make it a day of empowerment. And we are singing, singing for our love. So my charge to you tonight is for all of us to continue to understand the power that we have as individuals and as a community. And for us to know and to do whatever we need to do in order for us to continue to advance our human and civil rights. Another unnamed person whose age was not reported on May 9th, 2015, also in Maracaibo, Venezuela, the victim's body showed signs of torture. Unnamed, age not reported, date not reported. Campeje, Mexico. Body partially burned and one leg was mutilated. Gaya Borgi, age 48, October 9th, 2014, Montemor, Brazil. Anaya Asia Parker, age 47, October 2nd, 2014, Los Angeles. 
Milena Lucas de la Cerda, age not reported, 2715, Cubatao, Brazil. Milena was a person of color. Too many names, too few of us here to remember and to honor them.